you had fun here? Yeah. Nemecolon Woodlands? Yeah, me too. Pretty fun. I just gotta plug this guy in. Anybody need a cigar? <laughs> ah, there we go. Yeah, this conference has just been mind blowing for me. Um, so many wonderful new ideas, so much information to, to take in. Yesterday we had great talks about brains and boobs and <laughs> bodily fluids. <laughs> and uh, I think I'm going to wake up tomorrow and just be like, what the heck happened to me? <laughs> How am I ever going to process all of this information and all of these new ideas? So I... Um, I'm not really gonna smoke this, I'll just set it here for right now. <laughs> uh, I wrote a song, and um, it will hopefully uh, maybe serve as a little mantra for you all in processing all of the information that we've taken in. It's called Think, Remember. Use your brain, think, remember, it's okay, you can do it, what did I say? You remember, use your brain, think, think. Think you can do that? Use your brain, think, remember, it's okay, you can do it, what did I say? So I've got <clears throat> one more song for you. And um, as a songwriter and a, a musician, the main question people ask me is, how would you describe your sound? And uh, it's always hard to answer. And one of the answers I give is that I write Mr. Rogers songs for neurotic grown-ups. <laughs> so I think that kind of aptly describes what I do. And Although that's kind of a joke, um, Fred Rogers is my number one songwriting influence. I think that no one used the medium of song better than he did to, to teach children about their emotions and about the world around them. And the thing about a song is that it, it's a very powerful teaching tool and it's a simple tool, um, much like a story in the talk that we heard the other day. It's a, very simple way to convey your ideas and feelings. And um, I wanted to write a song that was a tribute to his songwriting. And uh, in it, um, if you listen closely and if you're a fan, and you, I'm sure you are, <laughs> uh, you will hear about 14 references to Fred Rogers' originals. And um, I kind of wanted to interweave his words with my own um, to kind of, you know, 30 years later, uh, show that, uh, kind of give an answer, so to speak, to his question, won't you be my neighbor? And um, that answer is yes, I'll be your neighbor. So I'm gonna play it for you. Mr. 
Mr. Rogers taught me lots of important things, like how to keep a fish alive and tie up my shoelaces, and that to be correct as usual is pretty unusual. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Cause the very same people who are right sometimes are the very same people who are wrong sometimes. And some and sometimes I'm that person, but mostly it's you. Pussycat fly, I learned to be brave and then to be strong. Cause if I can be brave, then I'll never go wrong. Tree, 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 tree. We love you, we do. Oh yes, tree, we love you. Just like Daniel Tiger, I'm feeling so shy now. It would be so cool to go to our correspondence school. Hey, neighbor, Aber, guess we'll see you later. When I feel so mad, so mad I could bite I take the mad that I feel and write a song to feel right I found many ways to say I love you and I do Do, ba 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 You are my friend, you are special to me You are my friend, F-R-I-E-N-D It's such a happy feeling to grow inside And it's such a good feeling to be alive Won't you please, please, won't Thank you.